While an audit mandated by law for the 2024 primary election was on the agenda, 2020's general election had Minnehaha County officials' attention today. Kelloland's Dan Centella was at the meeting to show us where they agreed and where they sharply did not. An empty seat was tough to come by, as the Minnehaha County Commission heard from County Auditor Leah Anderson today. While state law requires an audit of 5% of precincts, Anderson says that doesn't go far enough. She wants a total audit of the June 4 primary election. And I don't think that 5% of an audit is an adequate amount to verify an election. Anderson points to the 2020 general election. She alleges that audit logs in the county account for just under 69,000 counted ballots. But overall, Anderson says there were more than 93,000 total ballots cast, a total difference of 24,508. I, well, for one, I'm looking forward to an explanation on the 24,508 ballot difference. It's um, it, the auditor's job to, um, you know, find that. And if there's a there there, I'd like to know about it, what it is. Um, look forward to that explanation in a couple of weeks. Just to clarify, that explanation can only come if I pull out all of the 2020 ballots and records. That would take more than a couple weeks. But Anderson agrees with Karski. She too wants an explanation. I would like to get to the bottom of that. Um, it will take some time and I will get it done um, as long as I'm not uh, breaking any laws. To release this and a screenshot of, a, of a, a spreadsheet that is supposed to be some smoking gun, there's just no there there. But Anderson's allegations and her not having an explanation for the discrepancy don't sit well with Commissioner Joe Kipley. We got some half-baked information here. Anderson disputes this, and this crowd behind her clearly had her back today. My spreadsheet is not half-baked. Um, I spent a lot of time going through those numbers. Um, the audit log is in a spreadsheet. Uh, it was converted into a spreadsheet, which I am not allowed to release to the public. In Sioux Falls, Dan Centella, Kelloland News. The audit for the June 4th, 2024 primary election is scheduled for one week from today. Anderson says three candidates asked for a recount, and that will happen the day before. Well, 